Welcome to 12th of June's Holy Blessings. Supreme Father says, May you be filled with peace and happiness by knowing the depth of purity and become a great soul. So depth of purity is not just brahmacharya or celibacy. Knowing the greatness of the power of purity and become pure, that is, become worthy of worship deity souls now, not tomorrow, not day after tomorrow. Do not think that you will become that at the end. End means when we are leaving the body or about to leave the body or the doctor declares tomorrow you are going to leave the body or after three months you are not going to be there so you start practicing meditation, you start changing your habits. No, that's going to be too difficult, right? It has to start now or not when we hear that nuclear war has started and the world is going to come to an end and end means the drama is going to come to an end and restart obviously. But the end, end time is not the time to actually do Purshat or to change ourselves or to change our habits or to change our behaviors is going to be too late. It's like sitting in front of your examination paper and you have just studied one night before. Imagine that. So this world exam or this life's exam cannot be passed like that. The power you accumulate over a long period of time. So God says you have to accumulate the power of habits for a, over a long period of time, not in the last minute will be useful to you at the end. To become pure is not an ordinary thing. You have remained celibate and have become pure. But purity is the mother. So celibacy is one thing. Therefore, to become the mother of peace and happiness with your thoughts, now this is important, not just celibacy, but if your thoughts are impure and you're still celibate, doesn't matter because you are in between. You're not neither here nor there. So your thoughts also have to be pure. Attitude has to be pure. Atmosphere has to be created pure. Words have to be pure and connections with others have to be pure. It's not that this person doesn't belong to my community, so I don't uh, think good to think good about him or I don't speak to him or her. But we have to talk to everybody. We have to be pure and have to have pure thoughts towards everyone and be kind and be polite. That is known as being a great soul. That's God's definition. Om Shanti.